Okay. Um, influence is the main um, currency in the game of Babylon 5. Um, you begin the game with uh, four influence, um, and there is a influence rating, and there is an influence uh, uh, status or influence uh, pool which is available to you every round. Um, if you begin your, uh, um, for example, your round with four influence, means that you also have four influence uh, available for the turns passing. Means if you do something which costs, for example, a play a card which costs you one influence, you apply one influence, so you have only three influence left to apply during that round. Um, if you, for example, would have four, would apply something like this, would sponsor a card which costs four, you would have only uh, no, nothing left to use for the rest of the round. Um, your rating uh, does not change uh, until you do something to change it and then you either gain or lose influence. Means if you gain influence, you gain one, uh, one influence in your influence rating and you also have one more influence to spend during the turn when you gain influence. Uh, when you lose influence, you lose influence in your rating and you also lose available influence due, uh, due to that. Um, the reason for that is that um, you can build your influence with the build influence action during the round and you, you can move uh, through till 10 uh, on your own. Means that uh, gaining 10 influence is rather easy in the game, uh, but uh, going from 10 to let's say 12, 14 and so on is uh, more uh, risky and more heavy uh, because you have to win conflicts to do that. Um, your influence uh, ratio is also uh, counted as power and power is the main victory condition in the game. So means that if you have for example as here 10 uh, rating of 10 influence you also have 10 power uh, for the victory check conditions. Um, there are cards which give you uh, victory uh, uh, or victory condition, uh, which give you more, uh, more power. For example, different agendas. So if you have an agenda which uh, provides you with, uh, with power, for example, this one, Peace in Our Time, which means count every three points of Babylon 5 influence as one power, uh, means that if Babylon 5 has 9 influence, it, this card, this agenda in play, will provide you 9 divided by 3, by 3 and more power for the victory check conditions. Means that if you have 17 uh, influence and this card in game, Babylon 5 has 9, means that you have 20 power, though you have only 17 influence. Um, 20 power is uh, enough to win the game if anybody, if nobody else has more than you uh, or the same as you. So you have to have most uh, of those of, of power uh, to win the game and at least 20. Um, but we will talk about victory conditions later. There is a distinct uh, difference between uh, losing and gaining influence, as I said, uh, which means moving uh, uh, in the rating. And there is uh, uh, difference to, uh, to um, applying influence means, for example, playing cards. Let's say again, this sector 90, which costs four, which was which would uh, which would uh, lower only the influence available during the turn. Um, and restoring influence, if there is a card which restores you, for example, three influence, you would move only the available influence uh, ratio, uh, but not move the rating. At the beginning of each turn, your Influence your spent influence in re is reset to your current rating. So if you end the previous turn on uh, having 17 of influence, uh, if your influence rating, you uh, begin the uh, you begin the next round with 17 influence. 